Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check it out how to make this dotted half tone portrait in Photoshop. I'm going to go with this portrait, and the size for me is 2500 by 1400. Good. From here, we're going to go to the adjustment layers and we're going to make it monochrome. Let's select the black and white. And we're gonna go back to the adjustment layers again and I'm gonna select the levels. I'm gonna adjust the contrast, I'm gonna pull the right side in. When you can see this empty space, all you need to do is pull this little arrow in. So you're gonna increase the contrast. And from here, I'm gonna go down to the little plus, create a new layer. I'm gonna go up to the edit in the corner and let's select the fill. Make sure to select 50% gray. Click OK. A right click on the layer convert a smart object and now from here we're gonna go to the filter filter gallery make sure to go to the sketch and let's select here the half tone patterns decrease the contrast to zero I'm gonna put the size on four but you also can experiment with smaller dots or bigger dots but I'm gonna go with this go down and click here to the little plus to create a new effect layer and we're gonna go and click on the torn edges I'm gonna decrease the contrast some around seven smoothness is good I'm gonna leave it like this click OK from here I'm gonna go to the blend mode and I'm gonna change it to hard mix I also can invert the dots. By the way, this is pretty good already. But you can go to the adjustments. Let's select the invert. And from here, press and hold Alt and go down between the invert adjustment layer and between these dotted effects until you're gonna see this little arrow. There you go, click, so it's gonna be in between. So if I uncheck the invert, you can see the dots like this or inverted. Both ways looks pretty nice. From here, go back to the layer with the dots and we're gonna decrease the opacity a little bit. So it's gonna add more softness. It should be somewhere around like 70. And this was it, thanks for watching.